Now, Moscow played host to the American football finals over the weekend. Four teams from across Russia competed as the sport tries to increase its fledgling fan base within the biggest country on earth. Richard Van Portfleet has more. It's a world away from the NFL, but for the teams from Moscow and Chelyabinsk who are competing in the Russian-American football final, this was their very own Super Bowl. The sport is growing quickly around the country, and in just two years, the number of teams competing has more than tripled. But for Vasily Dobryakov, who's helped to coach at collegiate level in the States, there's still room for improvement. It's growing, yeah. Uh, it's more, it's, it should be more popular, because it's uh, right what we need in Russia, OK? It's a contact sport, team sports, uh, good-looking guys play tough game. Yeah, it's what we're looking for. American football receives very little exposure in Russia. There are hardly any games shown on cable, while the rules and terminology are more than alien to almost all sports fans. There are no Russians in the NFL or even in the collegiate system in the US, which would certainly help to raise the sport's profile. However, Dobryakov can see this changing in the not too distant future. We got some players. Uh, I really believe we got some players who can play in NFL too. Not much. For me, NFL players, it's like Collins. So I, I have no dreams about. But we got a couple uh, players from Yellow right now in NFL. So we can do it. I really believe that. Someday, yeah, Russian player in NFL. All the players in Russia are amateurs. They receive no funding from the state. So they have to finance all their expenses themselves as well as holding down another job. There are only around 500 players playing at the highest level within the country. Even Stelmark is one of them. He took up the sport after seeing it in films, and for him, there's nothing else he'd rather be doing. It's a contact sport, and it's the kind of game where it can let out all your adrenaline on the field, but it stays on the field. Once you come off the pitch, you are fully relaxed and friends again with the opponents. I love this sport. My wife isn't always happy with me, but this is my life. The final was eventually won by the Moscow Patriots in the black, who beat the Chelyabin scouts who come from Russia's Ural Mountains by 35 points to 21. And the crowd of around 500 fans certainly had a fantastic afternoon of entertainment. American football in Russia is growing slowly but surely in popularity. Well, it's never going to be able to challenge the likes of NFL Europe, let alone the NFL itself. Nevertheless, for a group of players playing out here, it's a great opportunity for them to play the sport that they've grown to love over the years. Richard Van Portfleet, Darty, Moscow.